Okay, so how can you add more widgets to the home screen of your iPhone? Now, chances are that you, for example, are in a situation where you have a full screen of widgets and full screen of apps and you want to add just more stuff. So there are a few things. First of all, you can still add like a new home screen because, for example, I have like six home screen pages, but I can still add a new one. So if you, for example, hold down anywhere on the screen like this, a new page is going to show up there by default. So you can always just swipe all the way to the right as you are in the edit mode. Keep in mind, you have to be editing it because right now if I hit done, the new page is disappearing. So just hold down, go to the edit mode and swipe all the way to the right. A new page is going to appear. And as you are in here, just click on the plus icon and just scroll through all of the available widgets and add the new ones. So it's really useful in that way. So you can add, for example, the app store widget, Let's say I add that the large one and now I have a place for more pages or like more widgets in here. If I want to customize the pages, I can hold down anywhere again and I'll click on the indicator at the bottom with the dots. When I click in here, you can see I have so many different pages available so I can manage it in here and those that have a check mark can be re-enabled so you can add more stuff there or, you know, you can delete the dolls or like hide them depends on what you want, but there is always more space for widgets. However, this is just the first approach. If you like to keep it all in one page or in many pages, you can add widgets in terms of a widget stack. So if you hold down anywhere to get to the edit mode, click on the plus and scroll down enough to get to the smart stack. This basically means that in whichever size you want, you can add smart stack of widgets. So I'm just going to click on add. And now this widget is going to contain multiple different widgets stacked on top of each other. So, so I have a photos widget. I might have some music widget. I have the Wikipedia widget. I have, you can see like the um, reminders widget. Many different things are available in here, which is very useful. Like you can see it right here that I can uh, switch and scroll in between them and it's just not taking up too much space because I can just scroll through them. It's easy. And I can also just customize it because I can hold down on it and edit the stack like this. And let's say I remove the v Wikipedia page or I reorganize them, do whatever I want. But this is also saving space. And this is an option how you can add more widgets to the um to the iPhone home screen and safe place if that's something that you're going after. So yeah, this is something that I wanted to explain to you for more information about iPhone and like learning a lot more about it. Definitely click the link down below in the description to join a free educational platform called Foxtag where you have more content available in terms of like video editing, in-depth iPhone guides and much more is coming. So definitely something to check out for now. Thanks a lot for watching and I will see you later on in the future videos.